Okay, it was the biggest mystery in town. Uh, you you like the, uh, the the attention though? Oh yeah, I loved it. I loved it. Okay, just walk us through it. Obviously, you had the early commitment to Arizona. Then ASU comes on strong. Uh, most guys don't pick between two rivals. How tough was it? And uh, you know, what was the final deciding factor? I mean, I woke up on Monday and I felt it in my heart that I wanted to be a Wildcat. It was it was a tough decision. Though. I mean, it was split. I went up to ASU for a visit and came back happy and excited. Like, okay, maybe I can see myself there. But um, I let the days die down and let my comparison, me and coach went over a list and I mean, Arizona was just a school. I felt it. Your mom seemed to be pleased with the choice. Was that part of it too? Or <laughs> was she? did she not say anything before then? Um, I mean, I sat down with the family, my nana, everyone, and we just really narrowed it down. Everyone had said what they had to say and explained why they wanted me to go to the schools that they wanted me to go to. And, my mom wanted me to go to Arizona. Obviously, you're seen as sort of a legacy. You're, you know, you're, you're Vance Johnson's a relative, and Josh Robbins is almost like a brother to yeah. you. How tough was it with uh, those guys, those uh, Arizona Wildcats of the past? I'm sure they were calling you and <laughs> dropping hints, right? Yeah, I mean, me and Josh talked. He talked. To, he told me, I mean, hey, it's your decision, but if you want to go on the opposite side and get cracked by me, then you can do that. So I kind of thought about it twice. No, nah, I'm not. No. <laughs> but uh, it played a big role. So you got Josh. And you got Jared there, and then you got uh, Blake in the uh, coming up. You guys gonna start ganging on Blake now and try and get him to Arizona? <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean, if he wants to go there, then I'd we'll be happy to have him there. What's your role next year? Obviously, they're kind of retooling the offense a little, going even more of a spread. So you don't have to be a huge back to gain yards here. Is that something you you looked at, and do you think you can fit in that system where maybe there's a lot of you know uh, quick handoffs and, and, and screens and things like that? Um, yeah, I definitely looked at that. They told me they were going to the spread. And I mean, I looked at that as a, that's what we run at CDL, so I'll be more comfortable with that offense. And they'll use me a lot more. Coach Stoop said that um, he's looking forward to having me there and we can start building some things around us. Obviously, it's basketball season, so you look like you trimmed down a little bit. How, how big do you have to get to, uh, you know, make a splash next fall? Um, whatever. They said they're going to put me at a comfortable weight, and I believe so. I mean, so whatever I'm at, I'm at. You know, all the, uh, all the talk is that uh, everything's A-OK academic-wise. You, you want to reaffirm that to the people? <laughs> everything's A-OK. I'm finished strong this semester, and I'll be a Wildcat. Great. Thank you very much.